Character generation, or CG for short, is adding static or animated text and images to your video. For example, the image of a station's logo that appears on the corner of your TV when you're watching cable or broadcast television is done using character generation. <laughs> Another example is a news I'm headline or reporter's <laughs> name that appears during a news show. The Data Video TC200 is a small box that uses an internal keyer to overlay or key the graphics on top of the video output of your switcher. The CG200 is software that comes with the TC200, which allows you to create text and graphics on your laptop. First, install the CG200 software on your laptop. Next, set the dip switch settings on the TC200. Switches 1 to 3 are the video resolution settings, and should be the same as what you have set to your switcher. Switches 4 and 5 are the keying mode, or the conversion mode, as you see on the TC200. For the workflow in this tutorial, we're going to use the downstream keying method. So set the dip switches 4 and 5 to HDMI titles overlay SDI in. And last but not least, set the switch 6 to dip switch. Next, connect the power cable to the TC200. Connect the CG200 laptop to the TC200 using an HDMI cable or the conversion cable from your laptop. Set the display setting of the CG200 laptop to Extended Display. Then, launch the CG200 program. Once you're in the CG200 user interface, go into the Settings menu at the top and select Run Initial Setup. Make sure that the mode is set to the resolution that you have set on the TC200. HDMI connection should be set to Auto. Click Next and you should see color bars in the window. Click Finished to complete the setup. Here is how to create a new title in Lower Third. When you open your CG200 software, first go to the upper left hand corner and click on New, and you will start a new graphic page. If you want to add a logo or image for your show, go to Add Picture slash Animation, and you will be able to import the image you would like to load. To resize the image, use your mouse to drag the image to wherever you would like it to be. You can then save the graphic page to bring it in with others that you have created when you do a full show. To create a lower third, click New again to make a new graphic page. To add text, move up to the icon next to the picture icon and add a simple object, which will load text and shapes. You can resize the text by dragging the edges to the desired size. To begin adding text, go to Edit Text, which will make the cursor appear. You can change the font by selecting the text. In Properties, you can adjust the transparency. If you want the text to be fixed, and not crawling or scrolling, set the movement setting to fixed. You can add another simple object to make the box or shape as a background for your text. You can add another simple object to make a box or shape as a background for your text.
add more text, click on Add Simple Object again. Set the position and add more text. To change the color of the text, select the text and click on the color icon or option to change it. You can add multiple shapes or just keep it simple. When you're finished creating your lower third, save it to import it later. To create a logo or bug, you can bring in text into the corner of your screen. You can also adjust the layers by clicking your text or images and adjusting the properties. All the CG pages that will be used during your show should be saved in one folder on the CG200. This way, the pages are easily accessible during production. The CG technician should be in sync with the switcher operator during the production to play and stop the CG pages according to the input that is being switched to on the switcher. By rehearsing this process, you can guarantee that your production will run smoothly. For more data video tutorials and to learn more about our products, visit datavideo.com or follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube.